first thing about your body that's good. If you didn't have knees, then you wouldn't have legs or feet. If you got, didn't, didn't have that, and that would be bad. Because then you would just be walking with these legs. That would be impossible. You think that'd be impossible? Yeah. Oh, you know people do it. Some people don't have knees. Without these legs and these yeah. feet. Yeah. But okay, so tell me something else about my body. Your neck, your neck is good because it brings down your food to your tummy. That's where you go. Yes. That's right. We need food to grow. And these little spaces between the fingers are where the body puts the bad blood. I didn't know that. What? Show me where. Where does the bad blood go? Show. It goes in these spaces between all your fingers. It does. And pinkies and thumbs. Well, what happens when that gets full? It's when it gets full, it gets into the other hand. But what and happens when that one gets full? They put it into the feet. In between your toes? Yeah. Perfect. Okay, so tell me something else about my body. Your, oh, your shoulders are good because if you didn't have shoulders, then you wouldn't have arms. So you would only pick up stuff with your legs. Oh, yeah. I mean your feet. Yeah. Sometimes people who don't have arms have to use their feet, don't they? And it's hard to use your feet. It, it would be tricky to learn how to use your feet. That is true. Yeah. Because your feet are small. Your hands are big. Yep. Yep. Hey, tell me something else about your body. Your arm. If you, you then have these space, these spaces, buds, mm -hmm. when they come out, they dry up and they hurt forever when you, whenever you touch them. Hmm. Okay, tell, tell me something else about my body. Scoot back a little bit. Your ears are good because if you didn't have ears, you won't be able to put nice ear, golden earrings on your ears. Oh. Or hear stuff. Oh, yeah, that's important too, I guess. Hair's good because hair goes from your only red to part of your body. Red it, parts it, of your body. It don't, hair grows on red parts of your body? No. Your hair on your head goes on the whole red part on your, on the top of, and, the, and behind the ears. And, um, so the why mind. do you need hair? Why is hair good? As if you wanted special and special hair dudes, then and you then that would be good. And if your parents wanted them, oh yep. Yeah. So you have to have hair if you want to have special hair dudes, huh? Yeah. If you didn't have hair, then it would be just. Pitch white. Pitch white? Yeah, because when you have hair, it's pitch red. When you don't have hair, it's pitch white. What does pitch white mean? You know the white parts of your body? Uh huh. Those parts. Oh, okay. 
Marks are good because if you didn't have a mouth, you wouldn't be able to grow. Because? Because when you eat stuff and when you like do this, it goes into your tongue, all the way to your battle, belly where you grow. Oh, that's right. And your mouth is the opening for all that, isn't it? And your teeth are the chopping. That's right. Teeth do chomp it up, chop it up. But if you didn't have teeth or a mouth, then nope. Then you, then you won't be able to go. Oh, so sad. But if... It's okay if you don't have any teeth, because you can make teeth out of, like, plastic, like, cans. Really? Yeah, and you would clean them up. Okay. Do you know anybody who has teeth like plastic cans? No. No. But that's good for you. That's good, so you can eat. Okay, tell me one more thing. What's the most important part of your body? Your belly. Why is that? Because your belly has your heart. Your heart is the most important thing about your body. Why? Why is your heart the most important? Because your heart is what makes joy. Your heart is what makes joy. You're making my heart feel a lot of joy right now. Joy is what kindness means. Your heart is what makes people happy. Yeah. That, that's why your heart is the most important. Got it. Thanks for sharing all about my anatomy with me today. There's still more. There's still more. That's good for tonight. Save it for another night. Good job, Dr. Ty. I'm not a doctor. I'm a scientist.